Almost five years ago, we stood on this very ground and commemorated the, the, the preservation, the reclamation of this part of the battlefield. And to think that five years later, <clears throat> the ground directly behind me, which is really some of the most hallowed ground in America, um, is about to be reclaimed in a literal sense. As the buildings and the pavement and the asphalt are stripped away. Is it is really such an amazing, amazing accomplishment. I was talking to Julian beforehand, and, and it's really, it's hard to believe the progress that has been made. I mean, this this was a dream. This was a dream of mine when, when I when I lived in Arizona. It was uh, it was a dream when I got the letter about the eastern flank, and, and that was following on the heels of this library project. And it was almost like the the dark before the light, and then the dominoes. Just, <laughs> Not that How about that for Freudian? The dominoes began to fall. And one more is going to fall. Franklin Charge just did the group of Civil War battlefield preservationists. Franklin Charge is Franklin. Franklin Charge is the community of Franklin. It's people that make a difference. What you all did was not just get into <coughs> politics and be serious about preservation but you got the whole community involved. And the consequence of this is that we're, we're doing some things, you are doing some things in this community that make the Civil War Trust and its 55,000 members want to get involved and make serious financial commitments. But everybody is involved in this and everybody is a winner. And it's not about preservation, it's not about history. It's about quality of life. We're you are making this community better. You cannot get a sense for the history of a place unless you can actually walk it. You don't even have to touch it so much as just to walk across it and imagine what happened there. And what happened here, where we stand and behind me, was truly an epic event. A veteran once told me the easy thing is to die in battle. The hard thing is to live with the memories and to watch it be forgotten. And there were many, many, many soldiers on both sides who tried so desperately to save this, to make it a national park, a state park, something. Not to commemorate war, but to remember it. They wanted this ground saved. We are fulfilling their legacy.